Hello YouTubers. Today we're going to check out two models. The model WOT6 World War II British truck made by ICM 135th scale and the British troops of Kane 1944. That is a master box limited model. And now uh, we're gonna check these both out. I specifically chose to do these both at the same time because I'm going to use these both on a diorama. So let's go ahead and look at this one first. Let's check out the box art. Great illustration. Those guys look great, look at that. And there is the illustrator and the sculptor for Master Box. Really, really cool stuff. Uh, glue and paint are not included. Um, there's the sides. And there's the back. And like usual, it's usually 14, 15 and up for these kits to build. That's the age they recommend. No one under three. Um, there's all the paints that you need. And uh, they tell you Vallejo, Tamiya, Life Color, Homebrew, Agama. Uh, these are the only two that I've ever used, Vallejo and Tamiya paints. So that is pretty cool. Let's take a look at this box. Oh, that one don't want to stay up now. There is the model WOT6 ICM World War II British truck, 135th scale. Made in Ukraine. Look at that, really, really nice. Waited a while to get my hands on one of these. Both of these kits came from the plastic model store in Ukraine. Uh, strongly recommend the plastic model store. They are outstanding. Uh, their prices are great and I usually buy in bulk. So let's take a look at these kits. Okay, here we go. We're gonna start off with the British troops. And there they are. Ooh, we even have decals with these guys. That is great. I love it when they come with decals. That means I don't have to try to paint things on. Look at those. That is great. Love it. That is outstanding. That makes a world of difference right there. Okay, let's take a look at these guys. Let's take a look at the head sculpt. That looks awesome. Look at that. Look at the straps and everything. The pockets. A lot of detail. Look at the rope. The rope is really cool. We've even got the collar piece here for this guy. And there he is with his beret. There's another guy. Got his chin strap for the helmet. That looks good. The rifle, canteen, pack, ammo pouches. Let's check this one out. Oh yeah, he looks cool. Look at that. Look at that head sculpt. He's got the toboggan to wear or beanie, some people call them. There's some rope. Wow, really, really nice kit. You take a look at that. That's what all comes with that. So that is the figure set. Masterbox makes outstanding figures, very detailed. If you like 135th scale models, to build them, to paint them. This is the outfit to go with. They're making some of the best stuff around right now. And uh, I can't, I can't speak highly enough for Master Box Limited. Check them out, all kinds of stuff, all kinds of stuff. 
Okay, let's move on to the model WOT6 World War II British truck ICM. Okay, let's open this box and check this out. Like usual, the ICM outer box, and then we have the box. Wow. Well, I can tell you right now, I'm already impressed. Already impressed. Just by the detail that I see just opening up this box. Very, very cool. Let's, uh, let's take a look at this stuff first before we get into the rest. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of funny. That's funny. Okay, let's look at that. Ooh, it, it's in color. Oop, there went my, <laughs> there went my decals. Okay. There are, look at, look at all the detail on that. That's, that's wild. This is going to be a great kit to build. This is, this is definitely, look at the engine. Wow. This is definitely not one that we're going to build and do a whole lot of weathering with, I think. I think we're just going to kind of do a very light weathering, just enough to make it look dirty on the diorama, but leave it open so that you can kind of see everything, because, wow, you don't want to waste all that detail. You definitely don't want to waste that. It would be different if it was just a cab and a seat and a steering wheel. But this one, this has got some really, really cool stuff. There's the paint job. Shows you the color. Wow, that is awesome. Really, really cool. And there are the decals. So we got them. Now, let's open this up. I'm going to close this box. That way it won't be flopping around. Okay. Let's open this up. See what we got inside. Wow, that's some fresh plastic smell there. There's our windows. There's our wheels, and those are rubber. Haha, <laughs> those are cool. That's rubber. That's nice. Here's where we get into all the goodies. Wow, man. There's the front of the cab. Fenders. Back of the cab. Top. Sides without the doors. It's like there's part of your frame. Part of the back of the truck. Look at the detail and all that. Wow. Awesome. This is really an awesome, awesome kit. Well, we can have a lot of fun with the wood paneling. I don't know, man. We may not be painting all this green. We might be having some fun with this. Wow. That is awesome. Get your wheels to go with those rubber tires, which is just great. Well, look at that. Get that screen up if we can see that. Look at that. Boy, that is nice. Your other wheels. Oh, there's a part. Looks like that's a fuel piece of a fuel tank. Okay, let's see what else we got in here. Look at that. Wow. Gas cans, seats, fuel tanks, bar. Have to be careful cutting that. Really, really nice detailed stuff. Look at that.
Oh, there's the other one. That one's gonna, we're just gonna take that off right now because that one's gonna fall off. And they just put it in the box. That is the same tree that I just showed you. It's just, that's the second one. And then here is the rest. Engine, look at the engine. Wow. We may even hook some wires up for them spark plugs. That is cool. Look at that. Look at all that detail. Wow. This is an outstanding kit. This is going to be a lot of fun. It's going to take a lot of time. It's going to be a lot of fun. So, that is the World War II British truck, model WOT6. I recommend that just by from what I've seen here. This is a model to get if you're wanting something highly detailed. It is worth the price. This is gonna be so much fun, putting this together, painting it up, and putting it on a diorama. Really, really cool kits. So let's just go ahead and Move that back around there and kind of see what we're going for. Awesome kits. Highly recommended. Check out the Plastic Model Store. If not, check out your local hob hobby store. Uh, even check out any other website for these kits. Uh, awesome stuff. And always, or as always, thank a veteran. Thank them for their service. And God bless.